Hello everybody. In today's video, we are going to talk about the why Wajin and what are its benefits. Um, I really wanted to talk about why Wajin because um, it has very good effects in some parts that the Wajin in reclining position, position cannot reach and can be even more beneficial for some of you guys. Hi, John. For some of you guys that um, that suffer uh, from poor erection and um, wet dreams, also that standing up to the toilet, waking up at night to go to the toilet, and also can be good for premature ejaculation. Um, I love Wajin. To be honest, I love making it more than Wajin in reclining position. Um, it gives me very good effect on my body. I feel great when I when I'm doing it. And first, how you, you need to perform it? Ah, you're doing Wajin Wajin now, and I'm talking. Good. Yeah, this is good exchange. It's very nice. So, how to do the Y or gym? You need a yoga mat. I use this yoga mats because they are not uh, thick like this. And I, and I use two because uh, it needs to be warm for your back. And I also am doing this thing, this move, uh, attaching the end of the yoga mat to the wall because you need you need to make sure that your butt your glutes are on a warm place um, because we know that the cold coldness is not good for practicing pyrogen and you go like this you attach your your glutes maximum to the wall like this and then spread your legs as much as you can and of course you place your hands up like this uh, of course for many of you guys who are not that flexible Wajin can look like this but the really important thing is to, to do your best and stretch them maximum uh, place them by naturally hanging down like me like like right now and this is how the white gene looks like and now i'm going to talk about what is written in the book of self-healing pyrogen for white gene and then i'm going to tell you about my experience and what i can feel about white gene and especially related with uh, male sexuality and male strength, main, male reproductive things. So, in the book is written that this exercise uh, can make the, the um, legs slimmer and it is good for uh, unblocking the liver meridian also the spleen meridian and the kidney meridian but for liver meridian this is one of the best exercises and also in the book is written that the liver meridian is strictly related to the strength of um, the erection to how strong is our erection um, in china they believe that our liver is strictly related to our joints in our body and they call the penis, the, our penis, they call it the biggest joint. They, they, this is the other name of the, of the penis. And cleaning the liver meridian pretty much helps for the strengthening the erection and feeling more power. Also, um, it can help a lot for prostatic problems. If you guys have prostatitis and things like this, um so by many things it can uh, it has the same effects as in the origin on the bench or 
The other name is Wajin in reclining position. But the Y Wajin, there is one good thing, you don't need bench for it. And yeah, but oh, uh, some more about the theory. Yeah, you can, you, you also are opening the meridians in the shoulders. And it is super crazy uh, for, uh, with its benefits for the lower back pain and and sideways back pain. You know, in the middle and in sideways, it, it has amazing effect on the back pain. But what is my experience and how can I describe it as a result um, for premature ejaculation and um, for them? power for sexual power sexual strength um, it gives better results in the erection to be honest but better than uh, other watching on the bench but from for premature ejaculation i'm sure it can add some time but i'm not sure that it's as strong as uh, the watching in the bench but uh, if you don't have bench and uh, also, if you have if you have combined your uh, problems, not only premature ejaculation, but also with poor erection, uh, it is very good to put the YWA gene in your practice. And um, it is a very good way to diagnose, to diagnose yourself if you have blockages in the liver meridian. Um, the liver meridian is located on the on the inner side. And if you have severe pain here, here, you probably have, if you have here, you can have in the spleen meridian, kidney meridian, and liver meridian, some blockages here and here. But if you have here, it's sure that you have uh, some liver blockages. And also I realized that my morning erection, because I, I stopped having morning erections uh, many years ago, but now when I practice, Super hard watching on the bench. I wake up in the morning with the erection. But when I practice Y watching, I almost every morning wake up with erection. Mm, it is probably uh, better for the for erection problems um, from watching on the bench. So uh, it is not weak watching exercise at all. It has good effects on the prostatic problems on the urinary problems also and on the on the erection uh, and sometimes guys you can use that uh, if you just get bored of practicing every day watching on the table other thing is when you go to the hotel on you go on vacation somewhere and you can bring your bench with you and also there is no good place for practicing watching on the bench uh, you can change it with the with the y watching um, nothing bad will happen and uh, i did it many times and uh, it it helps for uh, keeping the effect from login exercises when you don't have bench near to you so it's uh it's very good exercise also i i love it to be honest i love it i love it and um, i wanted if something can cure my premature ejaculation to be this exercise but for premature ejaculation Wajin on the bench is better, but you will feel amazing by practicing this exercise. Uh, and also other questions you probably have how long to do it and can you do it every day? Yeah, you can do it every day. Uh, and how long to do it? Of course, there is no standard because every person has um, different uh, blockages, different diseases and uh, of course, if you are a dancer, if you practice regularly yoga, you will be able to stay longer. But uh, if you are an old man with many blockages, uh, with um, hard joints and uh, short joints, of course, you will be able to, uh, to lay less. And the, of course, the, 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 bigger, the biggest orientation of when it's enough of practice is the pain. If you feel if you feel pain, it's okay. If you feel bigger pain, it's even better. And if you feel like super heavy pain, 
it's amazing <laughs> yeah these are the basic the basic uh, theories of legend more time more effect more pain more effect less time less effect less pain less effect these are the two main main uh, walls of practicing Wajin and also practicing Paida. Um, also one the good thing uh, for practicing Wajin is like when you lay on the bench or when you do y line Wajin or even when you do the squatting Wajin that I mentioned earlier in my previous videos, when you do that, you can feel some parts of your body that ha that have uh, a lot of pain, and if you if you want to unblock this this part, you can combine your practice with paida. For example, you are laying on the wajin bench and you feel and you feel severe pain on the back of the knee and also on the hanging leg. You feel pain like on the on the knee or you feel pain in the armpit. This is um, this is a sign uh, that means that you have blockages, and if you want to cure them, even if you want to cure them even um, faster, you can do pida on those places. It is super good com combination of both. Um, also, one thing I wanted to say that. Uh, it is super cool trick if you don't have bench also to combine um, wild gen with the squatting gen. They they are they they will cover many many places of your body and uh, you can have a good effect from practicing both both of them. Um, I wanted also to say that I actually I'm selling benches and. Uh, maybe I can offer you the lower price in the whole European Union. And if you guys are interested, I can, um, you can, you can send me an email to discuss it. And yeah, um, also if you have questions, guys, um, I will appreciate them. And I will answer also one question that was from previous time, from my previous video. Just need to take a look. Um, ah, about the Kegels, yes, about the Kegels. Uh, how many minutes I should do Wajin to stop wet dreams? When did you see results after implementing Wajin into your PE program and how many minutes per front Wajin daily? Um, oh, so uh, this question is, I already answered that question in one of my videos. It's called Blogin Theory and the, uh, expectations versus reality. You can you can watch them, but I can I want to say one thing that for wet dreams, I think that Wawajin could be better uh, be, because when I look at uh, acupression healing points in the books that are signed for the curing wet dreams um, they are pretty much on the meridians that we stretch on the wyogen and for the premature ejaculation there are more points and um, they are kind of the same but there is more and that's why it's better to stretch on the wajin bench because we are stretching many meridians but if some of you guys are uh, super ambitious and want to feel what Wajin can do for them, they can do every Wajin exercise every day. Uh, also, they can do the three main Wajin poses to, to cure many, um, many sexual dysfunctions. Of course, more Wajin, more healing crisis in the beginning, but more effect uh, with the time. You can do every day Wajin on the bench, then Y Wajin, and then the squatting Wajin. You can do that every day. These, these three meridians are cleaning very good all the uh, meridians related to our sexual functions. 
in the beginning you can feel in, it's like exhausting yourself, tiredness, sleepness. Uh, you can experience like changing your smell from the mouth, uh, bad smell from the urine, uh, bad look like uh, it dark dark urine. But these things will disappear after some days, and you will have better libid, uh, more libido and better sexual functions in every aspect. But of course, the lodging on the bench is enough to, for good results uh, in premature ejaculation. Um, I cannot remember now if Jan or Jan, I don't know how should spell it, but Jan Bali or Jan Bali, sorry. Um, I don't know what was your problem, like PE or wet dreams. Uh, because there are many guys with wet dreams and uh, they do also semen retention. And for the semen retention, Yogin also will be super good for them because it opens a lot this part of the, of the pelvis. Um, this is something that you don't know guys, but it's kind of personal. I like drinking beers here in Bulgaria. I don't know how it's in your countries, but here is in Bulgaria, many, many guys are doing this. Uh, also women, we drink like one, two, three beers every night. Many people do that. Not everybody, of course, but many people. And I'm the same. And uh, when I drink like two beers or three beers, I wake up at night to the toilet to pee. But, um, but if I do more while gym, I, I don't wake up at night or I'm, I'm, I'm waking up for, to be uh, in the mornings, in the early mornings. <laughs> yeah. So I don't know if it's the same in the wet dreams, but the logic behind this, uh, behind this uh, thing for waking up is like here you have less energy, of course, but also less space. And by performing Yogin, we are opening a lot our pelvis and probably there is more space for urine, for prostate gland. And, and yeah, this, these discomforts can uh, disappear maybe sooner. Of course, guys, in every guy, it will be different from different Yogins, different experience different effects there are some guys that that is enough only 10 days on the origin bench and they and they are from 10 seconds to five minutes in the bed they, they are they are doing pretty good um in my experience i cannot say what was happening in the first 10 days or for, for the first 20 days 30 days uh, because of two things one thing is that i didn't I, I was a, I was able to like I was I had I was having more libido and I was experiencing like raising vigor, but till the first month and a half. But I was not sure why is this. And also, uh, in that time, I wasn't with with my girlfriend that I'm now. I, it was with my ex girlfriend, and she was having uh, but uh, she was having some reproductive issues, and we couldn't. Uh, have regular sex. And that's why I cannot tell you on exact on which day exactly what was the results, came the results. But I'm sure that after three months, the results was great. In me was the same, like always some seconds. But then with uh, after three months, uh, I was able super easy to last five minutes. If I slowed down, I could do prolong it to 10 minutes to 15 minutes and uh, yeah and sometimes um and sometimes of course if you are a fan of those things uh, it will be super easy for you to make tant tantric sex tantric sex is when you do it with super slow moves and your your uh goal is to to do it like a very long time maybe one hour, maybe 40 minutes, 50 minutes, one hour, and more than one hour. But with slow moves, while you're doing Wajin on the bench, it is super easy to control the moment of ejaculation with slow moves. 
with faster moves it's not so easy um, it's easier but not so easy but with slower moves you can do it very very long it depends on you and um, and yeah and how much excitement can you can you gain in your body um, thank you guys so much for watching this video of course you can I, i'll say it again you can go on reddit reddit cured by gibbon the same name as my youtube channel and yeah thank you so much guys you made my life super interesting and if you have questions of course you can send me emails and yeah i really appreciate your donations thank you a lot for your donations i i appreciate them super much because now i'm in not so good period with the money because i work as a children party animator and uh, after this covid things this more than three months i i now i have less job less less parties to make and yeah thank you guys i wish you great results of course i'm not god i cannot help everybody but i pretty much think that many many guys uh, <clears throat> who are who are enough uh, regular in their practice and pushing them, them, themselves enough they will see great effects in one month in two months or three months and yeah that's that really is my opinion of course thank you so much guys have a great day